Oh joy, it sure was a great day today. My old voice is broken. Anyways, I'm inside of Wayne, Nathaniel's house. I'm so happy that I escaped from his daycare. Excuse me, baby Isaiah. But who gave you permission to leave baby daycare? You don't ever try to escape my house. You are a very, very naughty little boy. Oh no, it's Wayne, Nathaniel. No, no, no. That's right. I am here to take you straight back to baby daycare where you belong. You will never, ever escape from this house. Now let's go back to daycare right now. But I don't want to go back to daycare. I am a grown up, not a little boy. I am older than you. You Filipino boy can't baby me. Excuse me? But how dare you speak to me like that? I don't give a flying sausage with cheese and bacon on top. I can send your stinky bottom to daycare whenever the flying heck I want. You will do what you are told. And that is final. Now, I will be taking you back to baby daycare. Because you are a toddler in my very own eyes. Ha 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 ha. Oh you're a silly Filipino boy. Why would I listen to you? I'm not a little kid and you ain't my daddy. Now shoo shoo, fly away you silly boy. Excuse me? I dare you to say that again. You better not use the Filipino boy terms in this house. Because if you do, you will get a punishment day. Stop being naughty right now. Hey, don't talk to me like that. I ain't your son. You are just a fake friend, I don't need you anymore. Now, let me go back home. You silly kid. That's it. You are being a very naughty little boy today. I don't care if you are a grown-up or not. In the Philippines, you are still a kid. Now let's start the punishments. Oh my, you booped your diaper. You got so scared that you booped. I knew you're still a baby. That is why you need diapers, so you won't boop all over my beautiful floor. Ha <laughs> ha. Anyways, let's start the punishments. First punishment, changing your stinky diaper, then I will upload it on my YouTube channel, so everyone can know what a big baby you are. No, no. Not another diaper. I'm going to escape. Nice try, little boy. You don't ever try to escape from me. That's naughty. Now I will take you back to daycare so I can change your diaper. Then I will continue the punishments. Second punishment, forcing you to drink 100 gallons of baby milk. Until you boop that diaper again, now drink all of that milk for me. Or there will be more punishments. I'm not going to drink baby milk, that's for babies. I don't want to be a baby again. Please. I don't care. That's what happens when you betray me. You will do what I say, you will become a baby. Now drink all of that baby milk. Or there will be extra punishments. Good baby boy, now drink all of that baby milk. I am not leaving until you finish all of that. Keep drinking. That's a good baby boy. You drank all of that baby milk. Now let's continue with the next punishments. Third punishment, forcing you to boop your diaper again. Now boop. No, no, no. Please, I'm begging you. Let me use the toilet. I'm not going in the diaper. Why are you treating me like a baby? I'm a grown-up boy. I don't give a flying sausage. Now you will do what you are told. Diapers is what babies wear. You are still a baby boy. Now boop the diaper. Or there will be extra punishments. I know you can't hold that boop any longer. Boop, boop right now. 
You have a diaper on. Good baby boy. Now that I changed that stinky diaper, let's continue with the last punishment for the day. Fifth and last punishment, sleeping forever. Now I will put you to sleep, that means you will be sleeping like a baby forever. You will never wake up, ever again. Now it's time to go to sleep. I have sleeping medicine, for you. Now stay still, while I put this needle in your back. You will relax once this baby medicine goes into your body. Shoo shoo, it's okay baby boy. You will go sleep in no time. Just relax, no screaming. Once you fall asleep like a baby, you will use a binky. Now time for you to fall asleep. Oh boy, he is sleeping. How cute, I am so happy that he won't be waking up again. That's what he gets for betraying us. Now let's celebrate, with some Filipino pizza. For real bro, we will never have to deal with that silly boy anymore. Anyways, let's get out of here. And we will go out for some nice pizza, for lunch today. Let's go buddy. Oh my goodness, there is a guy sleeping in my house. Wake up, time to wake up sleepy boy. Wake up now. Where am I? And who are you? Where's Wayne Nathaniel and John Paul? They passed away many years ago. But don't worry, you won't be seeing them anymore. You are safe now, you are already in my house. It's over now. Oh, I thought I had a dream. What year is it? And why am I here? I should be going back to my house. Well buddy, the year is 2125. So you slept for over 100 long years. My name is Roblox Kid. I will be taking good care of you. Things have been way different since the last century. Oh that's sad. So that means I won't be able to go back to my own country. I miss my family so much. How sad. I know that buddy, but you are much better here in the Philippines. But hey, it's over now. You have a new life here. You must be hungry, my little guy. How about some breakfast? Oh boy, my very first breakfast. I haven't had anything in years. I'm so hungry by the way, it's nice to meet you. My name is Isaiah. Yes, I know your name buddy. Let's forget your old life, and we can move on from there. It's okay, no need to worry. You will feel much better when you have your first breakfast. Oh joy, I can't believe. I survived this super long nap. I'm so happy that I will never see those boys again. I can move on from them and start my new life. Let's eat. That's right buddy. Wayne and John Paul are gone. Let's move on from them, they are already dead. Come on, baby Isaiah. Time for a nice warm breakfast, you must be super hungry. Have I gotten shorter or what? I look like a kid. I lost a bunch of weight as well. How silly, let's go eat something. I'm so hungry. Ha 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 ha, oh it's okay buddy. No need to worry. It's part of starting your new life all over again. Now that you're a kid again, I will be taking good care of you. Alright, buddy. Come on, time for breakfast. <laughs>